and we're live. My pleasure. Like if you couldn't notice, like from our inane conversation, we're all trying out to be on your idiotest uh, <laughs> show on, like on the that. Game Show Network, where yes. I watched a little bit of it, and you seem to be in a fun place where you get to make fun of dumb people and then say whatever you want and then just go, hey, but what do I know? I'm stupid too, right? And everybody's like, ah, he's he's also humble. He's not being a bully. And it's like, no, he's, he's bullying these people. Like, basically, it's hilarious. I love it. it. It is really fun to do. I get to just literally become the authority on if people are stupid or not. I get to castigate them for their mistakes. They're under pressure. They're in front of TV lights. A lot of people would crumble in that situation, but I act as though it's a regular conversation. They're just dumbasses. I make fun of them. I hammer them hard. And then I say, I'm going over here and go to the other side of the stage and make fun of other people. It's a dream it's a great time. It's a dream job. It's a dream job. And the whole time you're like dressed up nice, pretending to be like, you know, hosting the the price is right or something like we're yes. mean. Like that's who's the dumbest when, person or pair of people you ever came across? Like to where like it like it almost baffled you. Like you fucking retard. There were these two dudes that were these like really lethargic Persian dudes that were literally they were like Hey, bro. And they were really, came in real cocky. They were like, bro, we're going to t take this game, bro. We're going to kill you, bro. <laughs> and they got every question wrong. I mean, embarrassingly wrong. Missed things, didn't touch things. Time's running out. And I'm like, what happened to all the confidence? They're like, bro, it's okay. We're going to come back, bro. And just straight shut out through the whole game. <laughs> that was embarrassing for them and their people, probably. They probably got hate mail from their own country of origin, possibly. Yeah. All of what used to be Persia was pissed. Mm -hmm. Mesopotamia was very yeah, upset. All, all of the Fertile Crescent was upset by that showing. Yeah, yeah I watched, they were... From the Tigris to the Euphrates. You mm -hmm. watch those shows, and like, like I watch, I like, I like Jeopardy, and like, I don't know, mm -hmm. maybe every sixth, I don't exaggerate, sixth or seventh question on Jeopardy, I'm like, aha, I know that answer. And it, but, but I wonder, like, What's the pressure like? Like, like, do you just fold under that pressure? Like, even in an easy game show, like, like, like Price is Right or, or something like that, where you just got to come up with something. Like, I see people, like, everybody's like, $4.18, uh, $5.20, and then one asshole's like, $72? It looked like a fuck. I wonder if that would be me. I wonder if you just fold under that pressure with that studio audience and the, and the cameras and fucking. Well, it'd be even harder on an easy show, I think. So if you're on, like, Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? Or something. Mm. It's like I gotta get this right, or I'll look stone cold retarded. Like I have yeah, to know. Yeah, the embarrassment who, factor shoots yeah. right up. I have to know who the third president of the United States is. Like I have to know that. But if it's like, who wants to be a millionaire? And they ask you, uh, you know, uh, which of the following three are all Tsar Nicholas's children from the early 1900s? Which of the following three are Tsar Nicholas II's children? It's like if I don't get this right, nobody else here is like, idiot. <laughs> we knew who it was. Like they're not gonna judge you. Whereas. At and first, they do. I think the easier it gets on TV, the, ironically, the harder it gets. Truth. That's why with our show, Idiot Test, especially the questions get harder as the show goes, but the early rounds, they're very easy, but there's just a little trick, so we kind of make it that often the contestant won't get it or won't see it, and then it's just perfect fertile ground for me to make them feel like very, very small, unaccomplished <laughs> people because they really should have gotten it. And, you know, I never wanted to be a game show host because I always, you know, saw game show hosting as a little bit of a cheesy activity for a career you know that old blues traveler lyric or no that old uh, sting lyric they all look like game show hosts to me i'm like i don't want to be <laughs> a career that's made fun of as like a schlocky used car salesman kind of thing so i agreed to host it only if i could do it my way which was like for the first season they hired before we started in the first few episodes they hired a game show hosting coach that was like trying to get me to smile and be real cheery ben, are you ready for your first day of trading <laughs> yeah i'm and gonna hear a little like out that. of that ben he okay. Was ex exactly like that. <laughs> yeah. He was like back, he was behind the camera going like, smile. <laughs> and I literally would go like this. <laughs> just shake your and head I just refused. I agreed to host it only if I could do it. My inspiration for hosting it was a combination of Simon Cowell and that old mean British lady from The Weakest the Link. The Weakest Link. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I wanted to have cunt. people, yeah, people had to come to my gauntlet. And I don't smile hardly ever on the show. If I laugh or smile, it's because they really earned it and they genuinely said something that was funny or clever. If not, go fuck yourself. I'm going to go over here, another side of the stage. I'd like I to like fuck to... that old lady from The Weakest Link. You I would? Like, yeah, I think she needs it. 
I, I, I think like, I, I feel like that's ah. the problem. I, so you're I not like attracted okay, to wait. her. You're just offering her like a pity fuck. It's a service. No, I got one of the, it's one of those weird attractions to like women with short hair and like a business suit. The same reason I'm attracted to Rachel Maddow, I guess, who's not that pretty. And Hillary Clinton. And, you know, not his, gay, um, right? Young Hillary Clinton. Yeah. Actually, don't, yeah. even, don't even go there. No. Young Hillary Clinton is good enough. Good enough. Like, like, although we heard that expose wow. from like Bill's ex girlfriend about how horrible her hygiene was, so I bet that pussy was just a swamp of doom and despair. So, uh, so maybe not, young Hillary. Tell me more. <laughs> <laughs> well, you remember in the Princess Bride when they go into the the swamps with the with the giant rats, like the R O U S. The R O U S. There's I bet her pussy there. smells like a combination of ice road truckers and the deadliest catch. <laughs> <laughs> Just horrific, terrible. I like wouldn't it, want to be anywhere this is near working Hillary, for me. Hillary Clinton's <laughs> snatch. I don't know about you. Well, we were talking about Rachel Maddow and uh, that that old bitch who was yeah. uh, making fun of people. You who all the weakest link. Goodbye. You all the weakest link. Right. I thought she was gay but too. Who cares? The problem though with with uh, like, the thing that would concern me about making love to a woman that's as old as that weakest link lady is just the brittleness of the bones. You got there's got to be osteoporosis happening there unless they're chugging Boniva and. You're gonna have a woman who might be enjoying it for a second, but then she, all of a sudden she shatters on top of you. That's okay. You don't oh, like that. glass bones. That's, like if you were yeah, to like Mr. Glass. Stone in the last ten years. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus That's my Christ. That's my fetish. She's still a good lay. How old is she? Sharon Stone's hot. Yeah, but you can hear her hips move. I've heard. I have inside info. You guys <laughs> like, like, don't question. Hear her hips move? <laughs> yeah. Like that joint in your pelvis is just like the cartilage is worn out. Is that exactly? I wouldn't make this up right now. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> 